So anyway, Mike Pennington, what's your title again? Uh, besides oh janitor? boy, uh, pretty much the director of janitorial. Okay. <laughs> uh, director of global training, okay. uh, event marketing, and solutions hub. Got it. Yeah. Okay. So is part is SEMA booth creation part of your? Um, it falls under actually a bigger team effort. Okay. I mean, that's Got a lot it. of people in the company, from creative services to training to product marketing. I mean, it, it's a big team of people. You Got know, it. so I, no, but no one person to make credit for it. Yeah, totally. Awesome. Well. I'm excited to talk about nah, what you guys released. That is why we're here. We're That's so excited, we're here. yes. <laughs> so tell us about, so obviously the hybrid ceramic wax that you guys launched last year, massive success. success right. Just huge, right? Um, and so, did you, one, did you guys expect that? We, it, it went bigger than we thought. Okay. It sure did. So the embracement, the acceptance um, was awesome. You know, it was really awesome. So we knew it was going to be good, but boy, oh boy, it, it, it turned out great. Absolutely, 100%. And that was your idea, right? The hybrid solution, um, or the hybrid. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so did you guys know that you were going to have subsequent uh, products for that hybrid ceramic wax line? Was it not even a line yet? Like, um, I just, uh, well, you know how that says if I tell you too much, yeah, but uh, I think there's there's a master plan for sure. Okay, got it. And things fall into place, got you it. know? Now, it wasn't well by said. accident that, um, you know, where we're here, where we're at. Yep. You know, a lot of hard work, yep. some good luck, and we're good. Good. So what, uh, tell us what we got. Well, consumer side expansion. We're going to talk to Stoops, I think, later yeah, on the pro Stoop, side, because yep. that is exciting as well. Yep. But take that, they call it the blue bottle, as you well know. Okay. You know, everybody's yep. talking about the blue bottle. So take that, it's pretty funny because, you know, ceramic is a platform, right. you know, but you're surprised at how many people are taking that blue bottle and saying, hey, I'm used to, I don't want to wash my car. Um, I don't want to wash my car as often. Don't you have, I'm a, I'm a liquid wax kind of guy. Got it. Aren't you going to do something like that? So obviously, being that platform of ceramic, it can go into many different levels. So of course, we're gonna take that next phase and launch hybrid ceramic liquid wax. Okay. So how's it different than the blue bottle? Well, it's gonna give you better protection. Okay. It's gonna last longer, but it's gonna be a little bit more effort to put in there. Got you know, it. we're kinda of go back to the old wax on, wax off type of right. scenario. Right. So DA hand, um, but we're able to put more of the goods into it, if okay. you will, yep. to make it last longer. Typical spray wax, quote unquote, versus liquid wax. Okay, and easy on, easy off? It uh, is. A little bit of a learning curve, no learning no curve? No learning curve okay. at all. I mean, uh, some of our products are a little bit more, you know, you gotta be a little well, work with them, a sure, little finicky, yeah. yep. but this one, that was kind of one of the top things because it is a consumer item. Right, right. You know, obviously people want easy on, easy off. Got it. But, you know, with the liquid, there's going to be some sure. application, but really the wipe off is going to be that was dialed in very, very nicely right. uh, to um, be easy to use. Got it. And does so? Is there any? How would one use it? Well, first of all, you kind of go back to almost old school scenario. So you're kind of blending recent technology with traditional paint care because if you got uh, swirls, oxidation stains, all that fun stuff, you still got to remove all got that. It. There are no miracle products. Um, then. If you're working by DA, pick your favorite finishing pad okay. on the entire car, let it sit a couple minutes, wipe it off. Got if you're it. doing it by hand, you know, with a couple of minutes, you're probably gonna do half the car, quarter of the car, okay. and then wipe off. So you Got don't it. need to really, okay. doesn't dry the trim wide, none of that fun stuff. So a lot of those great characteristics that a consumer would normally like and expect, I guess is a bigger word, um, with the SiO2 enhancement that so we kind of want. more durability. That's more. correct, okay. yeah, that's pretty Any much what it boils down resistance? to. Absolutely, okay. of course cool. it does. Yeah, awesome. so it's amazing. It's great color. It seems like is that a by design? A, by design. By design. <laughs> you know, by design. And is that a? I'm like noted. It's the first time I've seen everything. So I know this goes into like the professional side. I think a little bit. But, yep, yep. But the colors are vibrant. A little bit uh, refresh of a look. Absolutely, right? absolutely. So, okay. Gotta have cool. some fun. And then uh, piggybacking yeah, on the liquid wax on yep. the ceramic. Of course, think about it for a second. You got a whether you got a ceramic hybrid ceramic wax, the blue bottle hybrid ceramic liquid wax, right. or any kind of ceramic right. coating for lack of better terms. Okay. Imagine the water beating, the self-cleaning, you know all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But imagine laying a traditional detailer over the top of that or a gold class detailer. You're gonna be working on that last layer and you're probably going to diminish 
or hide them? Or, um, well, no, you're going to diminish the water beating. Oh, okay. The right. way that water reacts Because a lot of people say that with the gold class soap, right? Like, oh, why am I not seeing the water beating after the, the gold class soap, right? That, uh, yeah, we'll hear that. That or even the wax or, but, okay. but mostly the detail. They go class detail. Got it. Think okay. last touch. Got it. Think okay. some of those ones that aren't going to maintain that crazy water beating the ceramic will give you. So we right. really want to show people, hey, if you're working on that ceramic line, mm -hmm. blue bottle, the new hybrid ceramic liquid, and you want a detailer, you definitely want to stay. That's why we wanted to also launch hybrid ceramic detailer, okay. because it's going to really keep the surface tension, keep that, let's call it, uh, self-cleaning attributes to some extent yep. going. Yep. And okay. you're going to want to it boils down to a system. How long we've we been talking a right. system for years. Totally. Yeah. So you could lay down. So can they all be used together? Yes. Okay. Because I know a lot of people are going to ask that. Yeah. Well, we just had a question like uh, not not too long ago. Is this like is it designed to go together? Right. Do you have to do all three? You, the answer is no. You can pick one, two, or three. But a really good combination might be let's call it twice a year. Okay. The new hybrid ceramic liquid wax. Okay. Okay base foundational layer right then let's say once a month once every six weeks you might lay down good old blue bottle so can you do you have to wipe in the blue bottle then or no, can at, you just at, spray it on and at that off? point you could probably just spray on okay. you probably don't need that foundation layer okay. because you know we already we, have it you've already put it on and then back to the detailer use as needed fingerprints dust bird drop it Got so it. this becomes a daily slash weekly okay so you can rotate that into your um, let's call it schedule of detailing, okay. whatever that may be. Can this be used as like a, a, a little bit of a waterless wash too, or not quite? Um, a little bit. It'll, okay. it'll be able to do that to some extent, absolutely. Got it. So it's not really designed to be a maximum, you know, like uh, the the drying aid. Or, the, uh, uh, yeah, the waterless. It's not quite that okay. lubricious. Uh, lub Got is it. that even a word, I, lubricious? You just made it up. It I sounds it good is. to me. That's extra scrabble points right <laughs> yeah, there. That is. It's more of a traditional detailer. Okay, got let's it. Do that, and yeah. the consistency of it is... Thin? Um, yes, more okay. like, like a, a traditional. That's correct. Got detailed. It. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And comes in a green bottle, which is, uh, looks great. And that is price a, point is going to uh, be. I think that's about. Sorry, didn't mean to cut you off. No, let me. Uh, You're going to get five dollars off, like similar, like you guys did with the the blue bottle stuff, I guess. I think the detailer is going to be. It's a twenty-six ounce bottle, okay. and it's going to be around sixteen dollars. Got it. Which okay. is not bad. And the hybrid ceramic liquid wax yep. comes in a sixteen ounce. It's around twenty-two, twenty-three, okay. twenty-three dollars. You know, and those are going to be actually shipping, I think, in a couple weeks. Okay, cool. So they're going to hit the shelves pretty early. I'm just hoping one slips in my bag. Well, just we'll see sand. how this goes. This then we'll is let you sand, know. right? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we'll see about that. Could be milk in there too. What's the scent? Uh, oh, I don't even know. That's a great question. I don't even know that answer. I do not know. Here, this is live product on the oh, okay. on the ultimate liquid. I, the color is really cool. Ooh. It smells good. Yeah. It smells fresh. What, what, would you, what would you describe fresh. that? I have no idea. <laughs> I'm so smells bad. good, whatever that is. I'm so yeah. bad with scents. I'm like, oh, is that blueberry? They're oh like, no, it's mango. I'm I can't like, even crack that open. Right. That's yeah. close enough. Yeah, smells close good. enough. Smells good. Yeah. <laughs> right on. Cool. So, price good. Yep. Okay. And then take that uh, step one more step forward okay. is the ultimate line. Right. We've had ultimate line for what ten plus years. Right. And it's kind of been chugging along as right premium. Right. And sales are great. People love it. There's a huge loyal following for ultimate. But we did a couple things with that. We said, hey, we think it's time to upgrade okay. both Ultimate Quick Detailer and Ultimate Quick Wax. Got it. And essentially, envision, if you will, everything that each one of those does has been turned up, whether that's gloss, slickness, okay. protection. So everything has been dialed up in these two Ultimate items. Yeah, obviously, some of you can see. Right. <laughs> uh, new label, new size, new sprayer. That Bigger. Yeah, it's uh, same bottle as the ceramic bottles. Uh, just sure. different color. Sure. Maybe. Sure. I don't know. What is, how many? Uh, 24. Oh, oh, 24. So, 20. so it's it is 24. Okay, yeah. Got it. Um, new sprayer, though. That's what's interesting. Got it. Okay. You'd be surprised. You know, you've tested a million sprayers. Some are great. Some atomize uh, very well. 100%. The, These two yep. are done. Eagle die. One has a great product and a horrible sprayer. There you go. And horrible that can make sprayer. or break the experience. It, 100%. So detailers and waxes need to atomize fine. Okay. And these are brilliant. These two So sprayers. I have a question. Yes. Then. Why not use this style sprayer on this? That's above my pay grade. Okay. <laughs> That's above my pay grade. It's a great question, but above my pay grade. Got it. So the people that love the ultimate line, yep. it's not going anywhere. It's actually just being improved. That is correct. Got it. And we have across a new the addition. Whole, okay. I was going to say, across the whole ultimate line, Those though? two for now. Those two for now. And then More we're going to gonna have a new called 
ultimate leather detailer. Interesting. Now you think okay. about it, we've had ultimate leather balm sure. for a couple years, more conditioning, rich nourishing, right. kind of that more traditional hot rod, Ferrari, exotic. Right. But how about the people that just, how many questions we get them all the time, hey, what do I got, I just got a new car X, right. what do I use to wipe down and clean up my leather seats okay. and protect them? Yep. We never had that in ultimate, ever. I actually think the most underrated product in detailing is like a interior quick detailer, like kind of what the wipes do, kind of. Yeah, but, but like extent. a spray and wipe, like whether it's leather or vinyl, whatever. Yeah, I mean, right? we, we have our QID, but right. which is safe on leather. Right. But this is going to kind of notch it up. Okay. Uh, we're doing some testing on this because it is a three in one. Okay. It is a maintenance. It is a detailer. Okay. Um, the cleaning kind of shocked us. You know, interesting. We'll, we uh, especially talked to Stoops right. coming up is it does more cleaning than you think. So you, you kind of think of a spray three in one in gold class right. within our line. Right. Great product, top seller. This cleans better. This doesn't leave any kind of shine. Mm -hmm. This doesn't leave it slippery. It's personally, and many of the employees in our office have said, why haven't we had this right. a long time ago? This is a great maintenance product, yes. but also a good, like, if you go on a road trip and your car's yes. a little rough. Yes. Got it. I don't know why we have not had this. Got it. And I, I've told everybody personally, I've told everybody that. So that's hmm. kind of a no-brainer. And it works, it's called Ultimate Leather Detailer, Detailer. but it works on all kinds yeah. of surfaces? Um, it's, well, if you're going to use it on vinyl or rubber, you're probably going to go to traditional uh, okay. quick detailer. Is it yeah. high shine, matte finish? It is going to be more of a satiny to okay. matte. Got it. So almost not like a perfect buff. sheen? That is correct. Got it. It's like a factory like a, that's sheen. Like, that sounds like a perfect, perfect product. Sheen. I don't know if there's a product out there called that. <laughs> I don't perfect know. sheen. Perfect sheen. Brought to you by <laughs> Jimbo. <laughs> well, next year. Now we have this on video and we're yes. going <laughs> that. Just kidding. Yes. That's awesome. No, I really think that's like one of the most underestimated products. The, again, we kind of just all looked at each other and said, what, what, talk about late to the market on right. this kind of product. But it uh, it surprised all of us. And is there a hole in the market for that? Like, is that not a... Because I know there's such an emphasis on like exterior car care. Does interior care get kind of pushed aside well, or, or not really? No, actually okay. a lot of people look at interior, you know, and that also opens up the market to not just... Let's call it men, right? But a yeah, lot yeah. of a lot of women, women especially want to take their care of their interior of their vehicle, right? Um, kids, dogs, running people yep. everywhere. They may not, you know, compound polish wax their exterior, right, but right. trust me, that interior is very wash. important. Or <laughs> well, you said it, but an interior right. is, you know, I can't say king to them; it's queen to them, right? You know, right? So yes, it's powerful, and yes, people have been asking for this, and simplicity is what yes. everybody wants right now. Yep, fast and easy. So oh. with that said, one product you haven't talked about yet is the clay kit. There you so go. So it seems to me like that simplicity and and a lot of stuff wrapped up in one. Um, it, tell us about the clay kit. It is. That's hybrid ceramic quick clay kit. Now we've had our smooth surface clay kit for years. Yeah, right. Traditional clay, if we call it traditional clay. But take a synthetic clay mint, which is not new. Right. You know, a lot of companies have those out there now. But how can we take that and and help people go a step further, no right. pun intended. Yep. And the process is simplicity, yep. and really to the person that may not want to do the multiple steps, may not be able to do the multiple steps, mm -hmm. all we simply did was take a proprietary blend of synthetic clay material, put it onto a traditional hand pad oh, okay. that people are accustomed to. Interesting. So it's uh, proprietary, yes. Then we take our ultimate, or our hybrid ceramic detailer, Got use it. that as the lubricant, and okay. then that leaves a little protection behind. So in one step, we're not telling people they're getting max protection, sure, right. but they're able to clay and get some form of protection. For example, I don't want to spend four hours on Saturday right. in my car. 100%. I'll do it this time, yeah. and then maybe in a month, I'll put on your hybrid ceramic liquid wax, or I'll use the blue bottle. This leaves the surface at least some protection right, right. behind. And then could you, so if you wanted to jump from this to say, the blue bottle or the ceramic liquid even can you better do that? absolutely even okay, better got it. even better got it even because i guess it's just a quick detailer not just but it's no, it's a spray detailer because but it has that protection from sio2 right. it's basically this is a smaller bottle oh of the hybrid ceramic detailer okay. that is sold separately in the larger bottle so if you look at got the first it. the first bullet talks about spray on wipe off protection so there's where we're getting that one step on the clay kit got is it. you're claying and adding some pretty good protection at the same time. As good as the blue bottle? Right. No. As, as good as the liquid version? No. Okay. But you got 
you know, maybe it's late in the day, you're running right. out of daylight. You just want to uh, finish it up real quick. It's protective. So when you're washing your car, yep. whether at home or at the shop or the, the office, whatever, what out of the out of the new products, what product do you find yourself reaching for the most? Is it maybe the ultimate quick wax? Like what do you when you're doing your own car or whatever, like what product do you yeah, what do you use? Like, what, and I'm, Ooh, I'm I put on the spot I now. I'm asking you to oh pick like, your favorite kid. Does it have but to be like, a brand new product? It doesn't even. Ha- it doesn't even have to be. Like, what's oh, your? My go-tos. I mean, I was gonna do that. Yeah, yeah. what are your go-to? My go-to. Yeah, well, I gotta, look, start with the wash, even. Um, I do a lot of ultimate wash and wax anywhere. Okay. Okay. Yep. Even though my car parks outside 24 seven, it's I'll, one of my favorite products. I will still leverage. Yep. I do it often. Okay. So I'm also gonna fall to hybrid ceramic detailer. Okay. Okay. But I've got M40. Okay. Is a favorite of Mike's Minimum. Low it. gloss. And then those are probably my th- okay. three that I go to all the time. Yep. Ultimate um, Quick Wax. Yep. I use a lot for protection because it's fast and easy. Yep. I do it often. I don't let it get bad. Right. You right. know, and then right. maybe once a year, I'll 110, 210 it. Okay. And, and then lay something down on top of that. So, like right before I came to see me this right. year, 110, 210. And I actually put the new M27 on it. And then do you tuck it in at the at the office? Like, no, and then um, sleeve it out. No, it works that 24/7. Oh, That's what's crazy. What I color know. is it? It's black. It's oh, a black Tahoe. No. Oh no! I know. No. So everybody chuckles all the time. How do you keep it looking so good? Ultimate wash and wax anyway. Got it. Literally, that's the answer. That's what you do. Yeah. The and then that. every now and then I'll give it a good wash, and that's more for the inner barrels. Right. Sure. Fender wells, yeah. all that kind of stuff. Well, you, know. you use the do you use the wash and wax anywhere on the rims too? Like all surfaces? Everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah. And wow. it, sometimes I'll I'll reach my hands in and get the inner barrels, but usually at that point that it's, it's time to put time to pull the power, <laughs> power washer out. You know. Agreed. Agreed. But uh, it's good. I even use them on the windows. Good towel. Yeah. Two or three towels per yep. window. Yep. Works perfect. Love it. That's awesome. So when is the release date for the? Re- say a couple weeks. Uh, weeks. Yeah, you'll find it a combination of online and there's okay. a couple big retailers that'll will probably have them available in these early December okay. for Christmas. Which is new now, right? That because is the blue date. bottle was like. Uh, January, February. That's correct. Like, so these will be going a little bit earlier, and okay. then you'll start to see them get even broader across okay. the, you know, let's call it Q1 2020. Okay. And everywhere, Walmart. That's AutoZone, yes. Then you'll start seeing pop up everywhere. Got it. That's Online. right. Okay. Um, and then how much time we got? What we got. We're at 18 minutes oh. right now. So whatever you want. That do. means we got three hours and tw- yeah, totally. 40 minutes we left. Got as much time as I'm you just want. Kidding. I'm just gonna kick back. Okay, there you go. <laughs> I'll have a conversation with myself, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, so, whatever. Yeah, um, tell us about RTU this. is fun. Now, okay. picture if you will, professional line, not new. Our detailer line, right? Hyper dressing, citrus power cleaner, plus all that, not new, right? But gallons, concentrate, right? Sometimes more difficult to find. You got to buy secondary bottles. You got to buy right. sprayers. You got to mix it down. Yeah. So for those people that may not quite understand that. Maybe can't afford a full gallon or five gallon of hyper dressing. Right. Or they can't locate them. Um, maybe they don't detail 50 cars a week. They do two cars a week. They don't right. need the volume. We actually are launching, believe it or not, what's called McGuire's Detailer RTU, ready to use. We've got four items right now, okay. starting from our hyper dressing, which is Fan mixed favorite. it one to one. That's okay. why that's why we picked it. That's yep. a good combo. Yep. And, and it's it means great ready to use because not only is it diluted, but it's in a 32 with the sprayer. Right. Pick it off the shelf and begin to go. And you can um, even dilute it more. Um, well, no, because if you start trying to cut that down, then your ratios become crooked. Okay, got it. So if you you can't just cut that in half again, it gets tricky at that point. <laughs> I would. Yeah. Okay. Well. <laughs> Actually, I like it at one to one. So I, yeah. I wouldn't. That's why it's, we it's went one to one. That yeah. that's a good interior and exterior totally. combo. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. straight, it's a little shiny. Well, if you cut that in half, it doesn't become. You got to do the mathematics on it yeah, at that point. Not it's good. not. It's not easy. <laughs> <laughs> Start scratching your head. Right, yeah. What am I? Thirteen point uh, seven yeah. to three right. divided by carry the. I don't not know what happen. it is. It's not gonna happen. <laughs> um, non-acid wheel and tire. Okay. No brainer. Got it. Yep. Now that says ready to use. It's straight. You don't need to dilute that down. Got it. But it's ready to use because again, it's in a bottle with a trigger already on it. Right. Sprayed on a factory OEM and it's wheel. Not 16 ounces, which is nice. So you're That's gonna get a couple cars. That out is exactly right. Then of course, Sigis Power Cleaner Plus. Got it. You know, no brainer there. That is diluted down, ready to go again at four to one. Okay. So, Perfect. undercarriages, wheel wells, vinyl, yep. um, all that scenario. Mm-hmm. It gives you that pro strength. 
okay. in that ready to use formula. And then a brand new one, iron removing spray clay. Yeah, what does that mean? Interesting. That is a great one because that name means a lot, right. but it can be confusing. Right. So what we mean hey. by that is, um, do do take D1801. Uh, D, uh, okay. okay? Yep. Wheel and uh, uh, paint and wheel decon. Yep. Okay. Think ultimate all wheel cleaner. That's One just a, okay. Too, yeah. So think that technology, right. but somewhere in the middle, we're going to lay down iron re removing spray clay. Okay. It's less aggressive than D1801. Okay. Okay. But it's pulling, what we did was pull the wheel cleaning part out of it and we added clay lubricity to okay. it. Okay. So, yes, you could use that, mist, wash the car, spray it on. It'll start to turn purple as it is. Is it got. foaming then? Or no, not really. Okay, it's not foam. It. It's more like a D1801. Okay, okay. okay. Less aggressive though. So you'll start to see it. You can take a wash mitt. You can agitate. Got it. You can take a C2000 or C2100 and begin to clay your car. Probably not recommended to go with synthetic on this because okay. you know how sticky synthetic yeah. clay gets over time. So if you're going to use it as a true uh, clay lube, use traditional C2000, clay. C2000, okay. C2100. Got it. So you can do a combination of spray it'll start to turn you could wash mitt it got it but that's not going to knock down over spray right but it's going to knock some fallout off right but then you're also going to need to maybe clay if you're really bad so it's, it's okay. a very versatile product and where are these are these online only no that's the that's the kicker here okay these are designed to be more over the counter really? it'll be available at autozone and o'reilly for their customers. You know what's so cool? So I, easy so, to find. Yes, and that's what someone just mentioned on a comment in one of my YouTube videos. He's like, Jimbo, remember when like, um, ooh, I see something back there. Yeah. Um, remember, <laughs> oh, oh, Wait, side mean, squirrel. My, uh, my seven up. Yeah, your seven up. I'm, my uh, I'm uh, decal, what do you want? No, and he goes, you know, remember back in like 2008 when a lot of the consumer grade products were not that good? Right, compared to professional yes, grade correct. products, there, right? there was a bigger there was split. a big gap, yeah. and then I think this is like bridging that gap even more. That is exactly you know? what it's Which designed to do. Which is nice for professionals too that can go pick up something off the shelf. Could you run out? Well, let's say I'm a professional in um, mid America somewhere. Yep. I have a used car lot, and I've got five cars on my lot at all times. Yeah, I'm not a big gigantic right. chain of car dealers. Right. I don't have the money to maybe to put out and, and, and buy those gallons of those right, fives right. and mix it down. This is a great or solution. Or I don't want to mix it down. Or I don't want to. I don't know how. I don't want to buy a, a metering system. I don't have that ability. Right. Or, hey, I've read a lot about these online. I've read about hyperdressing, but I can't find it anywhere. And I shop at AutoZone. I shop at O'Reilly's. Yep. Yep. You know, so that's going to be that uh, Rude, perfect. he's in an interview. Yeah, um, uh, yeah, I'll tell him I'll call him back. Um, hold on, could we stop this yeah. podcast for a second? Hey, Mom, how are you? How's the dog? Yeah. Okay, can I go? So this is, That's we're super idea. excited. Yeah. I mean, kudos to Mark, you know, Marcus Kleiss okay. and the whole team out there, I you know, know, and Ken and Brick and Blake for all the awesome. resale items. Yeah. It's going to be a banner year. We say that every year, cool. but this year, we're excited. Good. I mean, we're excited. I'm excited we're, to try it we've out. We've already put stuff up on Instagram, more videos yep. to come. Nice. It's, yeah, how can as, people follow McGuire's? Uh, yeah, <laughs> I think there's an answer there. You know, <laughs> as we're laughing. <laughs> yeah, just at McGuire's. There you go. Uh, that would be at, at M-E-G-U-I-A-R-S. <laughs> I'm super excited for you guys. I'm super excited yeah, to thank try you. it out. It's, I can't uh, wait. Yeah, we, we appreciate it. It's a lot of hard work. It's yeah, not easy. It's not easy. It's, not it's by, a lot of products. Yeah. And we haven't even touched about the professional line, it's so Mike Stoops is oh going to hop in and talk about that. Oh my goodness gracious, it's awesome. Yeah, it's That's incredible. I, I don't know if I remember in recent years this many items of this caliber right, right. coming out. Yeah, you know, so incredible. Pumped. We're excited. Pumped. Well, thank you again uh, for course. another awesome year. <laughs> Hopefully, this was fun for you too. Yep, and we'll see you down and, at the uh, office. I hope one yeah, day. Yeah, come on sure. down. I mean, I'm so cool. Me and me and the other Mike always joke like it always takes us like somewhere else to meet up, and yeah, I'm like and 20 like, minutes away. Yeah, the Google map says uh, <laughs> yeah. seven miles as the crow flies. <laughs> Pretty much. You know? <laughs> Pretty much. So cool. All right, man. Thanks. You bet. It. Bye bye.